It all started about 6 p.m. on a Saturday evening. I swore to myself I would never do acid again with Zach. This guy came up to me. He was obviously from out of town. He said, hey, you want one of these guys? We went to a cottage and, well, got into some mushrooms for the first time. I decided that a Starbucks frozen frappuccino was everything that I needed in that moment. 20 minutes later, the music wasn't sounding good at all. And so I said to my friend, hey, can you cover me while I go take a urine in the woods? It was some of the best shit I've ever done in my life. And I've done a lot of acid. Anywho, we just ended up chilling on some old lady's lawn, watching TV through a window. I got there, and some sick fuck spat on the back of my neck. <laughs> and I heard the noise just like that. I turn around, who the fuck is doing that? And then again, <laughs> It was bad. It was really bad. <laughs> he has a weird penis. So the next thing I remember is being arrested and brought to the hospital. And the first thing they did to me when I got to the hospital was stick a tube in my fucking dick. I talked to my IV pole for a little while longer and I blacked out. 15 minutes later, my heart is beating. My eyes, my skin tossing, turning. I'm having an anxiety attack. And then all of a sudden, this cat comes up to me, but it wasn't a real cat. It was someone I recognized from TV when I was a little bit younger. It was a cartoon, and it was Felix the Cat. And he said, it's okay. Just follow me. I honestly feel like I did a lot of cocaine yesterday, or maybe even that. I was under 18, so they had to bring me to another hospital. And I remember on the way there, I kept trying to get up and play with my knife. I don't own a knife. Sitting on a log, just right in front of me, was this goddamn huge man in a purple jumpsuit. He turns around and he's playing with his mustache like this, and he's looking at me and he's going, <laughs> wouldn't stop fucking laughing. Why are you laughing? <laughs> I laughed so fucking hard that I threw up all over myself. Take note. I'm an experienced drug user. War on caffeine! They found my brother lying down on the street, talking to the sidewalk, and one of his buddies passed out in an alleyway with one shoe on and a pair of pissed jeans. I am never doing acid with Zach again. Ever. Never trust a Listerine pocket pack, pack. Could be acid. Would I do mushrooms again? Yes. Mm -hmm.